<laughs> a fun day at the office for 27 year old gamer Dylan Beck. Armed with a modified Nerf gun, he's live streaming the action to fans around the world. So I like to play games wrong. I build controllers for different games out of things that you would never consider to be a controller. Oh, so janky. Beck, known online as Rudism, first caught international attention after conquering the game World of Warcraft using only dance pads. I can't believe this is happening, man. Viewers flocked to his online channel to catch his experiments. No! This motion sensing baguette making the perfect gun, and this kid's rocking horse offering a bonus workout. The way to move forward is that I have to uh, rock back and forward on the, on the horse. So that's how I accelerate. Or how about a set of teacups that fire grenades when you're thirsty? Oh, tea sip kill, yeah boy! The MacGyver of gaming creates circuitry to connect up everyday objects, letting him play games with everything from Doritos I broke my button! to a bunch of bananas. When I start to grip it, that's when it activates. Beck has a day job as a games designer, but spends another 20 hours a week broadcasting to thousands of followers through a website called Twitch. Viewers can chat with him while he's playing, rewarding him with subscriptions and donations. I make enough from this that I can fund myself to keep doing this kind of thing, and I can undertake bigger and crazier ideas, which is nice. His broadcasts take full advantage of Dunedin's Gig City status, a jump in video quality thanks to the lightning-fast broadband network Dunedin won in a chorus promotion. Having the gig is a massive advantage, it's honestly helped me out so much. I can stream at full HD, 60 frames per second, it's great. He's not always stuck indoors. Rudism once rigged up his real life car to play an online racing game. Barrel roll! Oh my god, I did a barrel roll! That was awesome! I got some weird looks from my neighbours because I was doing that in my driveway. Of course I wasn't actually driving the real car in real life. Oh boom! Yes! And despite the time commitment, there's no plans for game over. I won! Future possibility is limited only by his imagination. Dave Gooselink, News Hub.